Hi, my name is Peter Jonas. I'm an interior design craftsman. I have a store in Larchmont in New York, in Westchester. My specialty is working with fabrics. Take a look at this frame. This is a high-end design fabric, and we put it into a beautiful settings with stone moldings, beautifully full painted, beautiful crown moldings, and the lighting is also important. You bring out the design in the fabric. And I also hide a little 3D effect when the butterfly is a three three dimensional I use this many of my work I try to bring always a little bit of extra and um, if you look at on the bottom this is one of my uh, specialty also this is a, a diamond shape designed pulled into a three dimensional section so each individual piece is perfectly matched by still posing as a three dimensional it sinks into the wall give you a great effect of a three-dimensional design and also if you with a certain level of lighting you hit it you will also show the separate sections of the fabric or sides if you look at the next section this fabric is designed by an Italian uh, jewelry designer William Jovert and uh, his specialty is mainly jewelry he only made one collection in the past few years when he bringing actual uh, ruching into the fabric from the feel of wall upholstery section. This is also a seamless wall upholstery. It's look like wallpaper. It is padded and has a, wall, uh, has a wood frame underneath and it gives you a great cushion, cushioning and also sound um, absorbance. On the lower part, I also included a special effect. I built in a fleur de leaf with, uh, with nail heads. So you can even see the two different of the fabric uh, design. The third section, we have a beautiful print and uh, the fabric already speaks for itself. But we can take elements out of this fabric and transfer it into a baseboard. Like I took out the palm tree and I placed it on the bottom. I took out fruits and I placed it in the four corners and I upholstered with a high-end sheer fabric so the fabric itself becomes a total different fabric and you can redesign the actual fabric to bring it out more special effects and this is my all-time favorite uh, from the Livre collection this is a French uh, silk brocade fabric which has hidden effects the fabric background the brocade will disappear when you lowering the lights and only the main design will come to life with the right lighting the lower right lighting maybe we can demonstrate this later on or later uh, on, on the films also it's very very important in interior design to bring out soffits and and uh, panels this is just shows only a couple of inches raised panel when you cover it with fabric and you add a stone panel in the center it, it shows a beautiful and magnificent panel and it's only require a tiny amount of fabric one of my favorite uh, design in the business is to cover and make disappear the doors and everything is all matched in frames and fabrics are perfectly matched and when you're closing the door, your door disappeared. Many times happened, people came to homes what I did and they says, oh, what did you guys did with the doors? Did you remove that? And he said, take a little bit, I'll take a look at closer. And then you'll see the door is there, just it's completely upholstered. I done this entire showroom in fabrics and this is my other specialty base moldings are covered with uh, ultra suede and that's bring out also a special effect it's also sand absorbent and uh, you don't it uh, paint will never it's because it's not painted you never have to uh, have any maintenance with it and it's beautiful luxurious it's also protecting your furniture and as well as protecting your kids uh, <laughs>
Stone moldings, plaster moldings are of very important effects in interior design. Uh, these days, um, wood and plaster became very close in cost and we can create beautiful creations using stone moldings and uh, the also the important part of it have to be faux painted. The various difference of, of, of fabric applications uh, the possibilities are basically endless. The best thing to highlight um, high-end fabric is to frame it which is a very very important part of it and then with the right type of faux painting. This is one of my signature pieces. People have been recognizing me through this type of fabric applications over the two decades. This is a fabric border inlay. It's perfectly matched with the design of the fabric, but as the fabric turns, it forms a frame. I can carry through these in, in door frames, also on underneath crown moldings and the possibilities when it's a striped fabric has a separate pieces I could bring out the possibilities are endless I could create like 10 different fabric designs out of the same uh, fabric so I'll be starting a project next week in Manhattan I'm gonna be doing a master bedroom and a dresser area I'm gonna be fully upholstering even doors and soffits and walls with this fabric and I'm gonna do a self welting with a 3 8 inch diameter cord inlay on the edges which is gonna be framing everything one of my specialty also about my wall covering is my uh, wall coverings are resealable that's a very very important word most of the craftsmen who ever created wall coverings they only upholster but they cannot service the wall coverings my upholstery uh, systems can be serviced so let's see an example somebody has a leak in a floor I'm, I'm sorry somebody has a leak in a ceiling and we can know about it in time I'm able to remove this fabric and after the construction fixed I can reinstall it so in other words my fabric wall coverings are resealable this is an important part this is Peter Jonas and I see you next time we're gonna go in more into the interior design secrets